It is yet another joyful day to be the proud resident of Koshofe Constituency 2. The lawmaker representing Koshofe Constituency 2 at the Lagos State House of Assembly, Honorable Femi Sahid, flagged off commencement of the construction of Ikosi Sherry Community Mini Stadium in Ayedere Community of the Constituency. The groundbreaking event, which witnessed the presence of community leaders, traditional rulers, representatives from Lagos State Suburb, member Lagos State House of Assembly, community youths, Ikosi Sherry Local Council Development Area officials, amongst others. The 1,200 capacity stadium would be constructed in consonance with the best specification that would not disrupt activities of schools and its hosting community. As graciously signed this project for the people of Kotofe Constituency 2. It's a billion naira project. That is what you voted for. Some people will say, Kinofuwa. What we, APC, are giving you today is more than rice, gari, and all these kind of useless things they talk about. We are here to give our children, we are here to give our people benefit of why they voted for us. Honorable Femi Said, along with his colleague at the Lagos State House of Assembly, Honorable Abiodun Rekoya, who is the chairman, House Committee on Youth, Sports and Social Development interceded for the project not to disrupt educational activities of the schools in the compound in consideration of the concern of Super Project Supervision Team. Engineer Adeleke Peculiar, handling the project, graciously accepted to build a new 8-class duplex building and water system to pave way for a state-of-the-art stadium facility. We have a very big and football pitch. We have fun, we have everything. And that's why I agree with my peers that education that all this is not balanced. Any way to develop to be the international star. Why can't we tell Rose, Honorable Professor Mr. has already participated another fight from the state, as if we are the only one in Lagos State. I must give it to our Honorable. He has used this position wisely, judiciously, and I'm telling you, he is never an Honorable member who went to cash chief in an out of assembly. He went there to felicitate, to make friends, and to bring things to. He's not half that money that he wants to go to his pocket. The stadium is among the 10 mini stadia constructions going on in Lagos. The 1,200 capacity and 9 aside field with artificial turf will be completed in 6 months with a total budget of a billion naira. Mrs. Ade Konye, the Permanent Secretary, Ministry of Education, thanked Honorable Femi Said for his unmatched achievements in education and sports development. She believes the sporting edifice will improve students' psychomotor knowledge, complementing the efforts of the teachers for easy assimilation. We are here to discuss and to analyze the taxonomy of education according to the of Practices Theory, which identifies the psychomotor domain, the affective domain, and the cognitive domain. This is not just an avenue for our youth to engage and interact. It's an avenue to explore the possibility of human capacity development. There are so many young people who are in the university polytechnics and doing excellently well in many areas of human endeavors on the back of sports. Honorable Femi Sahid, in an interview, described the mini stadium as a talent-hunting edifice that will discover new stars and serve 
as an avenue to balance the educational needs of young constituents. He thanked Governor Babajide Sonwolu and Speaker Mudashiro Obasa for graciously considering his constituency worthy of the sporting facility. This is going to be an iconic project. It's a billionaire project that is going to improve the aesthetics, that is going to improve the landscape, the structure and the thinking faculty of the people of my constituents. And it's going to serve as a level, as an everlasting empowerment to the people of my community. Many of our old athletes developed from the primary schools, from the secondary schools. People like Henry Wosu was from um, St. Peter's College, Nakoka. Today we don't have facilities in our schools where children can be developed. And now we are lucky we have a governor who is passionate about sports and who is simultaneously developing 10 sports centers in Lagos. This is one of them. The dignitaries who graced the event were highly delighted over the construction of a mini stadium in Ayedere community. And these are the part of things that can make our youth to develop in, the, in terms of sport. A lot of youth, we go out there because an idle hand is a devil, Max or show. When they have nothing doing, they will definitely join back down. They will definitely do whatever it is not in society, but to, you know, to assist them even in the aspect of the uh, of the government, and that is why you see all of this happening through the Honorable Femi Said. Now development is coming now, and uh, uh, we are told it's going to be an international, international standard uh, uh, stadium. So, by the grace of God, we will also stand to maintain it and see that the facility lasts long for, for, for the oncoming children. Oh, Go be in my